Hey guys, we're going to Home Depot. We're just gonna go look at some wood for my tortoise enclosure. And we're just gonna see if we can find some wood. For the, uh, the bottom of the enclosure, and then we get the sides. We were gonna use this table right here for the tortoise enclosure to go on, but we decided to use this one because it is a foot longer than that one. And we just thought the tortoise table would be better on this one. So we went to Home Depot. In Home Depot, and we got two by ten boards and a five eighth inch thick plywood at Home Depot. We were gonna get one by tens, but they were so expensive, so we went by two by tens. to make sure all your edges are straight. So now that we got our sides up, we put our nails and screws in it. We just placed it on the plywood, so now we're gonna trace it and see what we need to cut. So now that we got the plywood floor that we cut over there, we have it on our tortoise enclosure, and now we're just gonna get our hammer and nail it all around. Now we just cut these boards, and we're gonna put another board right here, but it's gonna come to about right here, make it smaller, and we're going to leave room for the ramp so he can go up into his like upstairs enclosure. Finished the upstairs for the sides. Now we're just gonna put the floor, the plywood in. Then once that's finished, we're gonna put it on top of the bottom floor. So now we're gonna cut the bottom for the top enclosure. So we're gonna start cutting it. So we finished putting all this together and we just have to cut down here because when we put that ramp right here, it was too steep and he couldn't climb up. So all we had to do is cut it, then we put this back on, we tried it, and then he could actually walk up the uh, ramp now. So that was one mistake we wanted to. And as we keep working, we might face some more. But I don't know if I told y'all, but this board was all the way up to here, but we cut it, I think, about three inches. We cut that. That way, from here, I can kind of see him and just, so this isn't the height of all this, it's kind of lower. Just where these three plants are gonna be where I put them. So, right now my dad is cutting the side part to go right here, just so when he's walking up, he don't fall. This is gonna go like right here with the side part. Then it's gonna be all perfect and then we will start putting the uh, dirt, all that in, in the next video, and then my tortoise is gonna love it. The tanner kept going up this ramp and he kept sliding down, so we just have this tool right here and we just put um, little grooves in the board just so his nails can go in and he won't slide down. Put this board here so our ramp can sit on top of this without falling. See so yes, our ramp goes right there just go and put pressure and it won't fall down. Also, we just put a nail right here just for more um, stable. That way it can be more stable. And then we're about to put some nails right here to also make this stable. We just carried it from our work area and we put it right by our door. And now, in my next video, I'm just going to do a tortoise setup where I put all this stuff in. And what we got is ramp, he can walk up, and upstairs, his underneath, that can be his hide. So that's really it for the video. Hope you enjoyed, make sure you like this video and subscribe. And make sure you stay tuned for my next video coming out in like a week. And that's going to be his tortoise setup where I set all his dirt, put plants, water dish, all of that good stuff in. So make sure you, make sure you stay tuned. Bye.